Hey Talking Fam and welcome to another Talking Sports video and today we are going to take a look at yesterday in sports July 10th 2022. Alright so I think we have some NFL news to start out with today and that is Miles Garrett he turns up in Las Vegas at with the Cleveland Cavaliers at the Summer League so who knows maybe he's in the Play a little bit, who knows? Um, uh, yeah, guys, that's it on the uh, yesterday's news NFL. Now, let's move on to the MLB, and this is insane, guys. We have some very good scores from yesterday. The Orioles beat the Angels 9 to 5. The Braves edged out the Nationals 4 to 3. The Marlins beat the Mets 2 nothing in 10 innings. The Reds beat the Rays 10 to 5. The White Sox beat the Tigers 4 to 2. The Pirates beat the, the Brewers 8 to 6. The Royals beat the Guardians yesterday 5 to 1. The Cardinals edged out the Phillies 4 to 3 and 9. The Twins edged the Rangers 6-5. The Astros beat the Athletics 6-1. The Rockies edged out the Diamondbacks 3-2. While the Mariners edged out the Blue Jays 6-5. The Giants uh, destroyed and shut out the Padres yesterday 12-0. The Dodgers beat the Cubs 11-9. And the Red Sox beat the Yankees 11-6. Sunday Night Baseball. So that's the MLB stores of the night. And I think we're moving on to some NBA. Alright, so let's start off with the Summer League. Of course, <clears throat> the Sacramento Kings beat the Pacers 103-96 to with the top score being Terry Taylor. He finished with 16 points and 7 rebounds. And then the then Brooklyn Nets beat the 70 sisters 91-84. to The top scorer being Cam Thomas with 26 points, 3 rebounds, and 7 assists. So in two games here in the Summer League, he has, he has played two games, and he has 57 points total. Moving on to the Bulls and the Nets. The Nets beat the Bulls 101-69 to with... The top store being Quentin Grimes at 24 points, 4 rebounds, and 4 assists. The Wizards beat the Suns 97-72. Top store being Vernon Carey Jr. He finished at 7, 15 points, 11 rebounds, and 2 blocks. And then we have the Denver Nuggets playing the Cleveland Cavaliers. Denver won that game 84-76. Top store being Peyton Watson. 19.7 rebounds and 1 assist, and it was a tie as well, so RJ Nimhar Jr. for the Cavaliers, 19 points, 1 rebound, 1 assist. And then we have the Warriors and the Spurs. The Warriors take that one, edge them out, 86-85. Top store being Matt McClellan, McClellan, 22 points, 6 rebounds, and 6 assists. And then we have the Grizzlies beating the Timberwolves 70 to 63 with the top scorer being Sancti um, Aldama with 22 points, 8 rebounds, and 1 assist. And then finally, we have another double overtime of the day the Hornets and the Lakers 89 to 86. Top scorer being Cole Swider with 21 points, 4 rebounds, and 1 assist, 1 steal. So that is the NBA Summer League of the day. We also have some news. Uh, Dano uh, Gallinari signed a two-year $13.3 million deal with the Boston Celtics yesterday. And we also have James Wiseman coming back from injury yesterday for the Warriors. He played for the first time um, of the year, basically. So looking good seeing him back on the court. And... Um, and the Utah Jazz general manager says that there's no intent to trade Donovan Mitchell. So he's going to stay on the Jazz, and we will see what's going to happen from there. All right, next up we have the PGA, and in the winner of the Barbasol Championship is Molinats. And, and uh, 
<coughs> special um, <coughs> congrats to him. And then the other PGA tournament yesterday was the Scottish Open, and that one is going to Xander Shuffle with my, with seven under on the day. Second was Kitayama minus six on the day. And then finally, we have a celebrity tournament uh, last weekend, which was the American Century Championship with big names like Seth Dell and Steph Curry. We also had Tony Romo, um, Charles Barkley, all of the great guys, celebrities and gals. Top, <clears throat> the top uh, first went to Tony Romo with 62 points on the day. Great, great playing by him. He beat Mark Mulder and Joe Pavleski in the playoff. We have Adam Phelan as well, who placed fourth, tied for fourth. Um, Aaron Rodgers placed ninth. Um, Carson Palmer placed 15th. John Smoltz played, uh, placed tied for 16th with Steph Curry. Dell Curry placed tied for 18th, so right behind Steph Curry. So Steph did better than Dell. Um... Derek Carr placed 21st. Tom Lavin, 26th. All of Joe Buck placed 31st. All of those good players placed in the top 50. Alright guys, thank you guys for watching today's video. I really I really appreciate all your guys' support. And um, please like and subscribe down below. I really appreciate it. Like, peace!